This is the Animation Minute. As always, let's start with jobs. ILM London is looking for animators. Fudge Animation Studios is also looking for 3D character animators, as it says here. DNEG is looking for an animator as well. Maya tweets here that they're looking for freelance animators. Player First Games is looking for senior animators. Switching over to the Animation Challenge, the next one is going to be in partnership with Riot Games, which is really cool. If you are a Marvel fan, then you will like this compilation trailer celebrating their movies and the upcoming slate. I'm a big fan of Nintendo and Nintendo Switch, and they have announced a new game where you can build your own games. Always great to hear tips from people in the industry, and here's a good thread, so make sure to check it out. Here's another good thread, and this time it's about pay. And another good question and lots of good answers about how to increase your animation speed workflow. I cannot agree more with this animation student tip number eight. You can do a lot with short shots. It's a lot better to practice with short clips. I can 100% endorse this tip. Here's a thread on job applications and rejections. Make sure to check it out. It's a lot of cool info. Here's a cute little test with set interaction, which I love so much. This is for an Ongi exploration test. We had made a fourth view with you, and this is a really, really sweet Boba Fett drawing. Cool turnaround, cool actions, cool presentation, really neat clip. Really cool stop motion clip, especially the framing right there. I love this. It's a great clip overall. Dancing on the Wii theme. I'm not going to play the music, but check it out. It's really cute. Look at that. Love the art, love the color, love the theme. Everything's very, very cool. Sticking with Zelda. Always like this. Great cape animation as well. Also love simple animation tests with simpler rigs, but you can get a lot of personality out of that. I love Batman, and that is cool. Look at that. Very, very neat. I love all these. Another cool test. <laughs> I like that look. Play it with sound. It's a longer piece. It's really, really funny. That is cool, too. Look at that. This is a progression reel. I can scroll forward. You can see the final piece. Love the physics. Love the look of this. Really cool poses. The Mitchells versus the Machines was a fantastic movie. I loved it from beginning to the end. Nick has a lot of posts, retweets a lot of posts. Just generally check out the hashtag. I'm going to go through a few. You got artwork, you got tests, you got live tweets from the movies. That movie is on fire and so is the internet with all kinds of stuff. I love this here. So good. And this test is cracked me up in the movie. And you get a bit of a thread about the idea behind it and why in the process. It's just really cool. There's so much awesome information about that movie online. There's an animated short called Concrete. It's really cool. Cool idea. Nice presentation. Make sure to check it out. There's a tank game pitch. I love those cute little designs. I love the presentation. That's so clean and awesome. I love these. Go check out the original tweet. It's a really cool clip here from the uh, Tangled series. I'm not going to play the sound piece of copyright, but this is really well animated, really cute. Make sure to check out the full clip. Easy fabric animation tutorial, as it says. <laughs> it is easy like that. It's very cool. Make sure to check it out. Another tip here. This is a Maya item tip for workflow. Yep, pixel art. You know it. Come on. So cute. So cute. I love it. And look at that. Actually, one of the ones I haven't played. So after this, I just bought it for the Wii U. I had to. It looks really, really cool. And I always miss pixel art Metroid games. So there you go. There's one I haven't played. This is something that Thomas did here, reminding him of the last night type of work. Very neat. I like that too. Cool look, cool lighting. And last but not least, here's a cool motion capture session behind the scenes footage for the latest Resident Evil game. Very neat to see this all in action with the props and the scale differences. It's very cool. And that is that for the Animation Minute. You will find it on my channel every Monday at 10 a.m.